the long-awaited Halloween party finally came. On October the 31st, Abigail received the jack-o'-lantern from Uncle Josh, and she decided to do something herself for the Halloween party. Thinking of the trick-or-treating activity at night, Abigail decided to buy some candies with the money she earned from the farm. She went to the food mart close to home and picked 12 types of candy packs. After arriving home, Abigail decided to find out how many candies she had in all. She found each pack had 37 candies, and she had 12 packs in all. But this is a two-digit multiplication. She was confused. How can I find it? This leads further into multi-digit multiplication questions. We have learned about area models before. This time, we'll make use of them again. Let's take a look at the factors. They both have two digits. Thus, we need to divide both into two parts. This brings one more role to our area model. Similar to what we have done to find 46 times 8, we first convert the factors to expanded forms. For number 12, we have 1 10 and 2 ones. Thus, it can be divided into 10 plus 2. For 37, we have 3 tens and 7 ones. Thus, it can be divided into 30 plus 7. The equation thus is now 30 times 10 plus 30 times 2 plus 7 times 10 plus 7 times 2. The remainder of the work, again, is simply doing easy multiplication and addition. The product of each term are 300, 60, 70, and 14 respectively, and we add them together. Thus, the final product of 37 times 12 should be 400 and 44. Abigail finally got the answer and enjoyed her Halloween party. How about you guys? Did you get the correct answer?